So when I look for new talent at Caterpillar, I'm looking, I look for um, their technical capability, their passion, um, how well they will fit in a team environment because we very much operate in a team environment. So this is not you know, a, a field or a location here at Caterpillar where you're just gonna sit in the corner and, and all by yourself. Um, your ability to, uh, and your comfort with being out in the real world to operate, not just sitting behind a desk and writing software of which we do do that, but your comfort in, your desire in to be able to go out and interact in, with equipment like we see here today in the real world where it's actually performing at a customer site um, real work. We are involved in the NASA robotic mining competition. We have been since its inception in 2010. Um, Caterpillar has been kind of the primary um, corporate sponsor with NASA of that competition where the goal is to robotically or through remote control um, or autonomy uh, excavate material that is like the lunar soil and then deposit it in a collection bin. So STEM route reach at Caterpillar is very important. So the NASA robotic mine competition is one of many uh, competitions that Caterpillar is involved with and supports. And it's a part of our overall approach at STEM, encouraging young people to be in, to, to, to go into career paths of uh, engineering, science, technology, and it's part of our, it's part of the process in which we go through to help ensure that we have the talent that's needed uh, here at Caterpillar to support development of our products and services to provide you know, the value that our customers need around the world. I really enjoy technology and its application and the effect that it can have in the world. So, and one of the interesting things and um, exciting things for me in my role is the ability to work with some of the younger people that we have coming in, especially in this technology space. I find it to be a very mutually beneficial relationship. So I bring to the table a lot of experience about Caterpillar, what Caterpillar is like, etc. And they're bringing in all of this knowledge about technology and my opportunity to learn from them about some of the amazing things that they're able to do. So there's a lot of news and a lot of press about Google, automotive companies, et cetera, uh, with automation of cars and, and things of that nature. And one of the things I tell when I'm involved in recruiting of young people that have this interest in robotics is, yes, those companies are doing those things and that's great and fantastic work, um, but there's also some hurdles for them to ultimately put things into production. It's not just technical, there's also regulatory boundaries and things that they have to overcome. Um, here at Caterpillar, we have a little bit different situation. And so we have a customer base, especially in the mining industry, that is pulling on us very heavily for the technology. So Caterpillar is a place where if you're really excited about robotics, automation, autonomy, that you can work on projects that are going, you're going to see very soon go into production. You're going to see it in the real world, doing real work, having an effect in the world.